Well, hello there, Shirley Rocks here. Welcome to Beetle Uprising. So, uh, there's been a, a new Beetle Uprising update. This is currently still in beta. It's not for general release, but you can opt into it under Steam if you apply the latest beta updates under the properties for the game. If you if you don't know how to do that, just uh, let me know in the comments and I'll uh, post a link. I'm sure there's a pretty much there should be links to it on YouTube how to do it. Anyway, so there's been a number of new fixes to this. So um, there is going to be some uh, Steam achievements. These are currently locked at the moment until it hits general release. Um, apparently, um, Steam Cloud saves are now working. Uh, they, they have mentioned it's a bit tricky to test this um, in the beta build, um, but it's again that's going to be another thing that's in the general release so you have to opt into that so i've currently not opted into that at the moment got a bit of a problem with my uh, my beetles at the moment they're all utterly miserable as you can see i've only got a few of them that are happy which this is stopping me sending a lot of them out on missions mainly because of sleep because i've actually run out of um beds i've got no beds so they can't sleep i mean i can feed them food but they can't actually rest I mean, that's stopping my beetles growing up because I'm trying to get some of my armoured ones up and running now. And I do have some nice, nicer stat ones. I've got some uh, armour 41s here. want to use these to breed, but it's struggling to level them up. In fact, one of them's just dinged and levelled up there. So, yeah. Um, another new thing to talk about is my purple army so you may be wondering why every single beetle i've got is purple that's because one of the new features so one of the new features is beetle visuals so if i go ahead and click on a beetle now if you look here now we've got uh you can store um various if we, if we go down here we've got the blank slots you can store the visual looks and restore them so if I, I've got these stored here, so I've got a purple, I've got uh, this reddish one, I've got the yellowy one, the green one. So if I want to change that one there to green, I can do, as you can see now, he's, uh, let me, there you go. Yeah, he's lovely and green. You can change the different angles at the top now rather than uh, from the arrows. So if I wanted to go ahead and make my whole army a green army, I'd, I'd uh, select green in the little slot at the side click apply as you can see that's starting to make them all green and the opposite way that you do with storing the colors is this so say i've got this uh yellow on here and i want to create that in a, in a new blank slot click on a blank slot start slot i cannot speak and press store so then you can cha change your colors to what you like so uh, the developer said the sort of idea behind that is uh, if you want to preserve a look that you like or you want to make all beetles one attack type look the same so I guess you could have all the healers a certain colour or you could have all your melee like blue or purple or whatever um, you also now get trophies for this is different than the actual steam trophies so you get trophies for, for doing a, a three star thing on a mission so I've got some in here so as you can see, I've got some trophies here. I've got a cleaning up trophy. So if you go ahead and stick that in the base, you can now see I've got a bucket on a stick. Um, I don't believe they actually do anything, but they do actually look nice. So I've got the red rock one here. So you can see, look, I am the uh, the best at that. Can I move that once I've placed it? Let me move it. Let me move it. I don't think you can. Hey, there you go. I can make my trophy room over here. Pull my trophies down. I got a trophy there for rolling along. Yeah. And I got another trophy for toxic waste. That's pretty cool. Look at that. That looks good. Uh, have I got any more three stars? No, that's it. Yeah, so that's another new feature. There is a couple of new exciting areas on the map. So if we go all the way over here. We've got enter the beta, enter the beetle map. It's now complete along with its mission. As you can see, I have not actually explored this one yet because I don't think I've actually got the ability to unlock this just yet. 34% chance of unlocking it. The last time I sent someone out, they died. So that, that's getting left at the moment. We've also got uh, Toads of Obliteration. Now, Toads of Obliteration is a quite interesting map. Um, it's an always hostile area with no combat mission, but the tasks have tasty rewards, including interesting eggs. So, hmm, should I send someone or not to try and unlock these? I will do. 
Let's see. Let's see if I can send anyone to actually unlock these. Hopefully I can and they don't die because I will cry if they die. All right, let's fast forward these. So we're sending both of these out on this mission. Um, there's been also, also, let's do this on slow actually. There's been loads of little tweaks as well. Like say if, when you're clicking on um, beetles now. There we go. Come on. Show me the beetle. Show me the beetle. Oh, I can't click on him because he's out of the mission. So you got these now, these stats down here. So these are pretty cool. These, It's just like a visual thing. doesn't really seem to do anything other than look a little bit different. Depends. It's like, it's like the, uh, DNA strands. Uh, 1 minute 20. Uh, what else is new? Um, there is new decoration objects as well as the trophies. I know one of the new things I got before. Let me just pause this. Uh, I got an 8 billiard ball, which I don't remember getting before. And I've also got a plush fly toy. I think that was the only new things I had. Uh, so as you can see, that's just another visual thing for your beetles to uh, play with, uh, dance with, do whatever the crazy thing these beetles do. So currently, I'm currently leveling up towards the next uh, ability. 35,000 XP I need, so we are currently working towards that. Okay, we failed that one, and we failed that one, so we're <laughs> not, not done very good at actually getting either of these. So the thing that I've been doing at the moment is to try and get some of this good stuff back. It's a pain to do, but it's the only way of doing it. There's two, there's two um, different ones I've been doing over and over and again, grinding, which is a pain. Uh, I've been doing Lost Beach and our nests. I've been doing those ones because they're quite quick. Now, I have got some happier beetles now. Let's have a little look. Let's see if I can send some of these and get some resources. 24% uh, chance of success on that one. 23% uh, chance. 25%. Yeah, let's go and send you on that one. We really do need... I, I need... I need people to come and... Uh, get me <laughs> materials uh, let's send them out so we've only got a few and then while they're doing that let's sort these by quickness let's try and find one that's quite uh highly not repaired but we've got high energy high health even right we need high quickness for this because i want to try and whiz through this level so this one's fairly easy to do you need to just kill all the uh, beat all the other enemy beetles in a set time. So a load come out of this bush up here. So we'll send them up there. Try and catch that one to the side there. Probably missed it now. Send him down there. Okay. There you go. Send them back over here. They, they also aggro when you get near the range of a lot of these. So you can just get away with just sending them out like this. There you go. Come over here. I think I've not seen you hiding up there. Try and split the forces for both sides. Okay. Go. That one's engaged. And who's left? Come on. Who's left? There's got to be one left somewhere. There we go. Last one. Come on. Fight. Yeah, so that's the only way I've been managing to do this quickly. So you see, I've got two nests from that. And this is the only way I can actually get them a little bit cheerier by doing this. So now, now I've got a chance of uh, sticking these nests down. Let's try and put them near the ones that need them. So it's, you need one because I need I need you to get in that. Get, get a... Um, come on. Oh, look at that. Big, fat, grown adults has just taken the bed. I want the little babby in it. So I've got two, I've got two left. These two here. These both need to be um, dinged up, leveled up. I mean, you're actually getting in a you're getting a little bit happier now you're sleeping. So I suppose that's sort of a good thing. Okay, it's, this one's just about to come back, and you failed, and you failed as well. Congratulations, you both suck. Right. Uh, put a few more and they keep, they keep wearing out all of me uh, fun activities there you go, Let's put a few of the uh, pet rocks down hopefully putting these beds down like this is going to make a few of them a little bit happier, see I've only got one that's sort of happy at the moment which is you, but you actually want to get to a 8 ball 
Come on, use it then if you're going to use it. Are you going to... you going to interact with it and get even happier? He seems to be. We've got the one over there as well. Nice. You'll uh, heal, healing up. Okay, so as you can see, I've got a lot of them that are really unhappy at the moment. So there's not a lot I can actually um, really show you at the moment. It's just a case of me uh, leveling this up, up offline. I will uh, do another updated video once I've got these all uh, healed up a little bit. Because as I said, I'm just keep doing these same bits again and again and again. And oh boy, it's getting boring doing it. Um... Let's uh, try and do this. I'll try and do this one quickly. This one, I need to kill all the enemy bugs. So let's just send a high strength one. Uh, you got no health. Uh, you've got okay-ish health. Let's send you. You're not particularly happily. Uh, oh, we've got two we need to send. Let's send them all. Come on. Let's go for it. So I've got loads and loads of eggs now, but I've got no real use to actually use them at the moment. Okay. I'm going to... First of all, no attack move over here and take out the spider. We do no attack because you get these ones here which will attack you. So hold down shift as you move and they will navigate and not attack. So I want to try and take this out first of all. There we go. Try and take out this spider. Come on, spider. Silly, silly spider. There we go. The spider is toast. Let's get the egg. Okay, who's got the best armor? These guys. Okay. Let's get these guys to engage. And these guys as secondary. See, these are a lot slower, these ones, because of the quickness. They've got 31, they've got 38. So, yeah, it's going to take a while. Come on. Nom, 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 nom. Right, we'll get the egg. Right, and we need the quickest ones, so we need to come up here and find all this now. Oh, just missed the egg. Come on, get the egg. There you go. Now, these are ones that explode, so the easiest way of finding and doing that is to keep running past them. Because they do, send, they do tend to explode when they're attacking you. How slow these ones are. The difference between that and that is ridiculous, though. That's that's 38, which is quite quick. That's 31. That's just so slow. We're going to send them into engage and then into engage. Okay, here we go. Here they all come. Come on. Nom, 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 nom. Nearly got them all. And then we can go and get the egg. Come on. <laughs> that, be that beetle went flying then. Right, these are both quite uh, weakened now. So I reckon um, send you round there. And we'll send you round there. Long way. And we're just going to send these fast ones. And keep having these fast ones come running through here like this. So here we go. I'm doing no attack a no attack move as well so hopefully they're going to come through a couple of them are going to detonate and the rest of them are going to get through see it's gradually wearing the numbers down for them there we go once your ants are through well your beetles are through oh the first ants of the video yeah once you've oh no 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 we don't want that to happen they've automatically aggro actually no we don't want we do want that to happen there's only one left there you go so that's the quickest way I found of doing that. So as you can see for that one, I got the toxic trophy, which is the one I put down the base. I got some leaves and I got another egg, which uh, it's sort of useful, the eggs, but I'm not really breeding much at the moment. I, I could go ahead and breed. Uh, nothing, nothing's really changed with the breeding um, at the moment, but I do need to get a lot more uh, of these higher levels. So let's just do a little quick breeding thing to end the video off. So I'm going to breed a high level armor, which is 40. And I'm going to breed you against... Ooh, let's try a high quickness. I would like to get a higher quickness. So zigzag. I reckon you'd be pretty good. Oh no, I don't have enough goop. 
Oh well, <laughs> I don't have enough goop, so I can't show you that. I could actually, how much goop do I actually need? I need 195. I could actually liquidize someone, I suppose. Let's have a little look. Who looks quite mediocre? Um, got a few mediocre ones towards the end. Mm, 39, no, you're not mediocre. What about you? You're quite mediocre. Let's, uh, oh, we only get 25 goop. I think we're still a little bit short of the uh, goop. Let's let's see what else we can uh, obliterate. Yeah, you. Come on, give me some goop. Right, so we were trying to breed you and you. There you go, we can now breed them. So this is 40 armor, 52 strength, and this is against 55 quickness. Let's see what you spit out. And there you go. Nothing really that fantastic. Wow. I mean, they've got... The, the good thing with these, I suppose, is if I sort it by armor, so we've got like a 33 armor, 55 strength. So the strength is higher, but that's explosive. I don't like the explosive ones. Um, probably more inclined to keep that one because it's higher strength, it's bite, and we'll keep you. There you go. And that's going to be it for this video. So this is Beetle Uprising Gameplay. I'm Shirley Rocks. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.